Hi everyone, this is a follow-up video of the um, video that I posted two days ago where these these two motors were twitching and they would just you know make the twitching sound and wouldn't spin or run. I was trying it with the servo tester and I have two four of these motors. Two of them were working just fine and these two were just twitching around. So I I did a, uh, I, I posted on uh, RC India forum and one of the guys uh, uh, suggested that I would just check the continuity of the motors. So <clears throat> here it is. Uh, I found really found the problem where problem where like on the motors about what, where what the problem was. Uh, it's pretty easy. You take a multimeter and you put it onto continuity. So they would just it would just you know make sound. So this is one of the motors. Uh, this thing like the bullet connector just broke off. How do you test these motors? Is you take any two leads and connect. <coughs> Excuse me, and they should, you know, actually give you a continuity um, tone. So I take one of the pairs. So the red on this motor, the red and yellow works just fine. You can hear the tone. If I do the same on the black and yellow, there is no tone even on the black and red there is no tone so the problem is on the black lead if I you know just twist it around then I get the tone and if I connect it to the ESC and the servo tester the motor just works fine perfectly there is no problem with the motor so the problem is that I'll have to strip this um, heat, uh, heat shrink and re do resolder the bullet connector um, so the motor is good uh, this is how you check uh, the motor via connect uh, continuity so in, in this we find that the black uh, black lead is not working fine there's a connectivity problem here uh, on the other other motor it's the same thing i'm using um, like black and yellow i have a tone if i do the same thing on black and red there is no see so if i move it around the sound breaks out so the problem is in the red cable. The lead here again, I will have to strip this apart and resolder it again. So if I just pull it up and down, I can feel that there is a gap between the bullet connector and the actual cable. So this way I found out that on this motor, oops, sorry. On this motor, the red cable, it has a uh, what you call soldering problem. So I'll have to strip this apart resolder it and on this motor I have a problem with the black cable so I'll have to strip this apart and resolder it again so overall this is how you check motors if they're twitching around um, the motors are good I thought they were bad and I was supposed to buy new motors but uh, I found out the problem was not the motors it was it was only the connectors so this is how you check motors via connectivity using a multimeter thank you